Hey everybody, I wanted to give an update on this because it's going to be the last video I make about this Mark I version of the Serial Effect Generator. So, I went ahead and magnetized 12 rollers total, and you can hear this running in the background, and it, the system doesn't like it a bit. With seven, as you can see, and I'm running off one Milwaukee battery. This is not reflective of it. Uh, but I'm running off the Milwaukee battery, and seven rollers for this unit is the magic number. Eight rollers, it hates it, it stumbles, it stumbles around like a drunk roller skater. It hates six, but seven runs pretty fluidically. It tends to do a little bit of a hang up, that's because the voltage is only about 11 and a half volts. So, seven rollers for this system is all I'm willing to do. Um, that's the most I can do. I did 12, 12 rollers and it would do nothing. It was so it's just an intense, strong magnetic field that it kind of killed it. Uh, also, this system was built such a long time ago and has so many flaws in it because the, the magnets are so badly done. So this concludes uh, this experiment. Seven rollers is the most it can handle. I'm going to move on to basically um, Mark II version. This will be Mark III and then I'm doing a Mark IV which I'll, I'll leave out of the video because it's not complete. So I'm going to have these remagnetized and then I'm going to put my field, my special unique field onto them and uh, see what happens with this. So this will be next upcoming.